Today we will be looking at more problems with Crab Legs and his server, created by the man, the myth, the legend, the Tank78, the King of Kings, King of the Internet. As King of the Internet, he obviously wow. needs no introduction. I've known of this tank character's existence for about as long as I've been nestled into my little friend group, but he mostly just floated around in the background. That's got to be the best part I've ever seen. So it would seem. However, he is responsible for some very interesting comments on my YouTube channel. Greetings, Crab Legs. How is your friend's side of the community going? And how are you? I have returned, not so long ago. But a lot of change, such as for the community, has occurred. When I return, people that I once called allies and friends chanted nobody cares, which then later on I declared war on my own, despite one sworn to protect them. Because I declare war on Shining, I was frowned upon. And fact that they say that they were trolling doesn't make sense when I am feeding on them. After that, I got into a war was crazy, and his friends. They tried to get me to end my life, but I'm not the one of the others that they had success in. They cannot break that has already been broken, so they gave up on me. Because of people like them, people are dead. People that were too young to live a normal life because that I want their heads. I already laid out my demons on them and they will soon die where no one follows. They have fallen into my trap I call my group in Empire, so someone like them will show up. They try to be strong and they only made themselves weaker in return. I see the minds of theirs, they reek of sociopath. And why I am telling you this? Just to warn you that there is a bit stabbing on the back. I, I, I can't. Huh. Well, um, that was pretty interesting. And also, I like making paragraphs, and that's why I hate Twitter and wanted to certain amounts of characters. Um. Is that really necessary? It's like you're making myself look stupid for explaining myself. On a less notable note, he replied to my update about Flame's reaction to my stream by replying, Hashtag free tank? If it's unnotable, then why are you talking about it? What the fuck, you big stupid idiot? Oh, I, have a, I have a question for you. Enough. On, um... On, on January 7th, 2020, uh, a tank messaged me. A good username should not be moderator. He keeps on muting people that did not even break rules. He also lets spies stay on the server, and by simply pinging the moderators for help. Did, can you tell me what actually happened? Uh, he pinged the entire moderator role, and he said something along the lines of, someone is a spy. And he didn't have anything to back this up, mind you. It was just because someone on that server was spying on his server, and so he automatically thought, Oh, uh, if someone hates me, they must hate everyone. What in God's name's all the Nogger's ass did you get that from? Try to give me 20, and I'm not talking about them push-ups, I'm talking about them $20! So, I muted him because he kept pinging people, and got into arguments with other mods, so I thought, fuck it, I'll mute him for oh. 15 minutes. Oh, alright. <laughs> That's what I thought. Um, well thank you. Problem. Did you just really believe in what that guy said? I mean, for real, without any evidence? Oh, that just makes me mad. Now right there, they're going off of um, this right here. And for some reason, I don't see that. I don't see me constantly um, pinging the moderators or getting in any arguments with the moderators. I don't see that. If, if, if you saw that, I don't, I don't know what you're all talking about. I mean, for real. I told you who it was, and then all of a sudden, I was just... I was just... You know, muted. Muted.
What caused Tank to make this video, you may ask? Well, buckle up, because this one is going to make you lose a brain cell or two. All of this started when a man by the name of Killamoth started treating my server like his personal jungle gym. It started with very minuscule things, like sending his quote-unquote art in general, and not, you know, the channel designated to it. But I drew the line when he started plaguing general yet again with just tasteless transphobic remarks, despite me, you know, literally designating a channel to it so that sort of thing doesn't clutter up my server. Assuming it was even a joke, but We'll get into that. Anywho, this was his response. LMAO fucking sensitive asses. They have a dark humor channel, but they can't handle the shit I say. Fuck them. They are the biggest snowflakes of all time. It, it baffles me that I can't even ban someone from my server, something that shouldn't even matter, without it, like, starting drama. Like, hey dipshit, you ever wonder why I made that channel to begin with? To ensure that you are in fact joking, and not plastering my server with unfunny transphobic shit? And if you don't like it, you can leave. Simple as, but oh no, I guess we're snowflakes now for not wanting to deal with your garbage. But anyway, shortly after, he went all around town squawking about how I was a bully for banning him for no reason. He proceeded to join Tiffany's server simply because I was there with his other shit-fucked friend to just, uh... I don't even know what they were trying to achieve. All I know is that it happened in her art chat and it didn't get me to unban him. He even got his own friends to come onto my server and ask me why I banned him. <laughs> like, there's childish and then there's just petty. Young one, kill him off, did not invite me. Well, then why did you join my server out of the blue and just immediately start talking about him then, huh? Anyway, let's address whether or not this can be considered a joke or not. Uh, in my opinion, no. Hey, idiot brother of mine, what's your side of the story? I don't really care about the drama anymore because it's actually pretty stupid, but I'll explain anyway. So I joined Crab Lake's server, you know, I was being a nice guy, and then uh, I saw this guy, and I'm not going to say his name, I saw him making a bunch of transphobic jokes, so I made one, I got banned. He made more of them, I didn't, he didn't get banned. So yeah, they're saying that I made multiple, um transphobic jokes but i really only made one uh don't believe what they're saying about that because you know they're just trying to make me look bad so yeah is that it yeah now the reason why i made the video in the first place is not because of my brother nah it was because i was banned that's the only reason why i made it it's not all about my brother all the damn time Fucking idiot. Mr. Tank caught wind of Killamoth's bitching, cause he himself joined my server and said the following. Your server has passed the test, scoring an 85. First violation was gore. Second violation, rules of the server. Third violation, bad rules based off of biased. This is not of the attention to attack or harass of the many states of Destructimus Union. I can't even pronounce that properly anymore. The name is just so fucking stupid. I can't even bear it ironically. Destructimus Union. This is not of the attention to attack or harass of the many states of the dipshit union. And also, you have been pardoned for the attack towards the dipshit prince. Now, honestly speaking, I think that Crab Legs really, really, really wanted to call my side and my brother, including myself, a bunch of dipshits. I mean, for real, that's basically all I have to say about that, because I mean, honestly, for real though, honestly. To prevent any further action of war, if you have a question, please DM me and I will not annoy you like you did to me. All hail! Man, I really got banned off of that shit? Man, wow. Man, I was just role-playing and, and you just had to literally ban me. I mean, I even got the role that says that. He was promptly banned because A, he's annoying, and B, he's only here to tell me how to run my server. But that did not deter him, oh no, and he promptly went into my DMs to spew this onto me. Honestly, I like that he's taking what I said to literally feel as if I'm attacking him for going like, Hey, your moderator sucks, dipshit! Lenny420 is fighting and moderating for the interest of themselves and not for the community. I gave you a score of 85 and I was banned for it. Your moderators are to blame for the recent attacks by me. I have pardoned you for your attacks to the throne. But you are not an issue, your moderators are. And I will not lower the score in the respect towards your girlfriend, although she does not understand me. 
I still respect are of amount of drama and wars that have been in your moderators create more drama more than I do. So I urge you to fight for the best of interest towards the community, for the safety of your members of your side of the community. As a leader of your part of the community, you must obey my order. Fix your server, or I will. Keep your moderators in line. I'm sorry if the narration of that was a little weird. He doesn't punctuate his sentences. Also, this just goes to show how incredibly out of touch he is. Like, me and Axel haven't been dating for a while now. So if he's saying I have a girlfriend, then I would certainly love to meet her, because as far as I know, I am single right now. As for the rest of the screenshot, I basically ignored it because it was nonsense, and why would I even acknowledge it? Appreciate if you would respond, because that's just rude. You can tell me to F off, and that's totally fine, but don't just leave me on read. Honestly, for real though, I thought Faggy was actually your girlfriend. I mean, for real, I really thought that she was your girlfriend. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. She wants to be called Axel now. Now, honestly speaking, this is just nothing but a communication error, but you probably won't understand that because you're too busy ghosting me like I'm an ex-girlfriend of yours. Man. Do I know you? Have I, have I spoken to you before? Like, I have had no beef with you before, so I don't know why you say once again. Ah, uh, well, there I go again, expecting rational thought from the disabled, so I guess that's just my bad. Uh, well, there I go again, expecting rational thought from the disabled, so I guess that's just my bad. This man is still referring to Axel as faggy. Get with the times, you disabled buffoon! What, is frickin' Togeist being ousted for being a pedophile? Are Clark memes still funny? Now, first of all, faggy, I mean, hold on. Faggot, uh, wait, no, no. Um, Majestic Me- no, no. Okay, Axel. Axel. She really changed her name so many goddamn times to the point that I only want to call it one name and that's it. And that is faggy, and cause, honestly, she really- change it to being faggot to faggy but honestly for real though who fucking cares because i mean in the end of the day she she really changes her name so many damn much times that i'll probably lose track eventually and not just that the reason why i'm so out of touch is mainly because i have a job and many of you guys won't even understand that so i'm not gonna get into detail about that already established my reasoning behind my actions. If you think you or your stupid ass brother are gonna get special treatment from me, then you can fuck right off. Do you expect me to give warnings for the kind of shit that he pulled? Like, this is how you adult. Remember, good little boy, read the rules and don't put your tasteless bullshit all over my server. That's a no-no. Now, honestly, for real though, I should've used the original script, to be honest with you, and... The one thing is, um, the original script really, really tells you a lot and how I really really don't really support my brother's actions but I was like you know what I'm getting too tired and you know how about I just wing it you know and just forget about the script and not finish it and just work on the fucking video so anyways um here's the original script and so, yeah. 78 here back in with another video talking about crab legs I once again I've been having problems with his discord server well one of them I got banned off of his role playing server for all. Playing as a person that was literally role playing as a you guessed it you know it as a server reviewer. But not so long ago my brother also did share the same faith except for the wrong reason that one would wish to get banned. He made a joke offensive towards transgenders and crab legs like most leftists and liberal minded people just flat out banned him and did not give him a warning. Now I have more respect for the transgender community way more than my brother does. Now this type of topic is something that you don't just force people to believe in you have to inspire them to change into accept not force them. But here he doesn't understand because he's too busy trying to look good for the crowd. Now the reason why that I have more respect for the transgender community is mainly because one they're doing something that I wouldn't do now I have the same opinion on racism but kind of different honestly I believe that racism shouldn't exist. Because the concept of multiple races within the human race is inhuman that only just alien at the human races was just god awful. But enough about that because it's kind of off topic because honestly this is a video about crab legs not my views because apparently this is political issue number one. Honestly, that right there I should have used the script would have been a lot more better and I should have finished the script and I should have actually do the video now. 
First of all, his video is too long, and um, I should um, make a part two about it, but I don't know if I'll come around to it. But anyways, please leave a like and subscribe for more, and see you guys next time. Goodbye. Tell me, tell me, tell me